What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. We are about to do a full wrap on this 250 right here. He's getting the full car transformation. Transformation. About to remove the spoiler. I already removed the door handles. But he's getting a, basically a full wrap. Front splitter, new grill. All right, so we strip the trunk. <coughs> Still about to clean it off, but basically wipe down this whole side. This car is getting a 24 hour turnaround on a full wrap, front, new front grill, new spoiler, new diffuser, new front lip. So about to set the camera up, jump right into it. I already took the antenna, the door handles, tail lights, spoiler, uh, stop spoiler, cause you're getting a new spoiler. And um, I'm about to jump right into this. And uh, show you guys once we get started. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. And uh, this will be a 24 hour wrap. Right now it is about 11 p.m. And we plan to have the car done by 11 p.m. tomorrow. So let's jump right into it. All right, all right, what's up guys? So as you guys can see, we have the front door uh, top part done and uh, the rear door is also finished. But so what we're about to do now is just finish this lower part of the door, move on to the quarter panel and um, try to knock out as much as we can in one day. So probably what we're gonna do today is finish the driver's side you know, get this 3M off of here, this uh, from where we took the emblem off. And then we're gonna move to the other side and knock that side out real quick. Move to the front bumper and the rear bumper. The roof is getting black. And yeah, so we have a lot of work to do in this 24 hour wrap. So let's get back into it. And I hope you guys, a lot more content to come. 24 hour wrap is insane, but let's get back to it. All right, so as you guys can see, we got the, the two driver's side doors done. About to move on to this quarter panel, and then we're gonna move on to the fender, side skirt, and then we're gonna flip to the other side. So i um, about to knock this quarter panel out, and then we're gonna take this 
the 3M right there off. And um, then we're gonna move on to finishing this whole side. And then we probably will knock out the roof next just to get it out the way. And um, yeah, so we're not doing the hood. Hood stand fully exposed, which should look pretty crazy, especially with this color. And um, then we're gonna probably start removing the grill, getting a new grill. Once we get to this side, I'll show you guys where we're at. Basically getting the same color, but satin. And um, definitely it's gonna turn out pretty fire. So let's jump back into it and let's get it. He's actually getting the emblemless grill, new diffuser, cause this old one he has is pretty messed up. So um, then we're gonna put this new spoiler on. We already took the stock spoiler off and then um, we're gonna get this front lip installed. So um, this is gonna be a pretty big project and uh, we're gonna get it all done in under 24 hours. Right now it's probably, probably about like an hour, hour and a half in. So um, we plan on finishing it by 12 p.m. tomorrow. So let's jump back into it and let's get it. All right, what's up guys? So it's about two o'clock now and we got the driver's side done pretty much. Just gotta knock out this bottom mud flap right here but uh, and do the door handles. But this side is completely finished. So now we're probably gonna move on to the roof next just to knock it out real quick. And then we're gonna start the other side. So, um, and then after that, we'll probably move on to the front bumper and um, and then move on to the trunk and the rear bumper so but yeah we're making good progress making good time uh it's about two o'clock so it's been about three hours probably been wrapping for like two maybe two and a half hours and uh yeah we're getting closer and closer and uh yeah so we're about to move on to the roof and knock that out and then we're gonna move on to the other side so let's get it All right, what's up guys? So we are finished with the driver's side. Basically, um, I just moved the car over so we could do the other side. So we're actually gonna knock out the roof first. This whole front end is about to get a complete change. Front lip, new emblems, uh, grill. 
gloss black. And um, yeah, we're gonna put a front lip on there too. The hood is not getting wrapped. This is carbon fiber, so that makes it a little easier, but we're gonna remove this, this door handle and um, get this side ready to be wrapped. And then we're gonna So, first, all right, all right, so, got a little chip mark on there, but we're going to go ahead and throw this on the gas cap, and everybody always asks how I do this, it's basically just my Between the spots, so it won't show. Making progress.
Drop a little bit. I get it's a, it's a little bit over to the right. Oh, Banger was in there. Hit different. Alright guys, so we are on to the last piece, the rear bumper. We already finished the front bumper, the fenders, the hood, both sides of the car, the trunk, and um, the last thing we have to do, which we're going to do in the morning, is the door handles. So we've pretty much been working on it for about close to 12 hours, maybe like 10, 11. Right now, it's like about... It's, 10.30, or no, it's like 11.30 right now. So um, yeah, like I said, this is basically a full wrap under 24 hours. Um, we're gonna have the car ready to be picked up by up around lunchtime tomorrow. Pretty insane to get the car done around this time. I, I do offer this service for people that don't really have the choice to leave their car for multiple days at a time. So um, I mean, hey, if you need it done, we get it done. But uh, so we actually, he actually ordered the wrong front grill for the car. So he's gonna come back this weekend and get that installed and he ordered the wrong diffuser for the rear. So um, he also ordered that too. So he's gonna come back and we're gonna reinstall, we're gonna reinstall the front grill and the rear diffuser. So the only thing we're gonna be putting on today is the rear spoiler, which is the last piece that we're gonna do. And um, the front lip is already done, which you guys probably already seen in the video. 
But uh, yeah, let's get into this rear bumper and knock this out. And then uh, we'll pretty much be done for the day. What's up guys, so it is 10 a.m. now the next day. Uh, we still got about an hour, hour and a half, but we are finishing the door handles now. We're doing all gloss black. Um, pretty much finished up. Just gotta do the antenna, put the the wing on the defeat on the rear, and the spoiler, and um, put the door handles back on after we wrap them and then completely mount the top mounts. Uh, so, like I was saying yesterday, he ordered the wrong diffuser and the wrong uh, front grill, so he already ordered that. So we'll probably be installing that on Saturday or sometime this weekend, maybe next early next week. So once we do that, I will throw that at the end of this video and upload it together. But uh, yeah, this thing pretty much turned out pretty slick. Uh, it's a, this is a popular color, so it definitely goes crazy. But uh, yeah, so let's finish these door handles, and uh, I'll show you guys once it's finished. Post heat everything, and then we're going to take it outside, and he's going to pick it up around 12. So, uh, yep, stay tuned for that. Doing the handles in all black. We basically have one more door handle to do. Just finished up this one. About to put it back on. And um, yeah, so we only have one more left. We're gonna have to do this rear back one. About to put this one back together. All right guys, so we pretty much are finished up. We just went ahead and installed the Stelling winglet and that made it look so much more aggressive. Once he gets the right grill, we're gonna throw that on the front and uh, replace this broken one, but that's gonna pretty much top it off. I mean, this thing looks so aggressive with the custom little signature I usually do, the same kind one I have on my car. Um, and this thing, man, definitely turned out great. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Like, comment, subscribe. Let me know what you guys think. Uh, let me know what you guys wanna see more of in the future. Plenty more content to come very soon. Um, next next couple days, we got a lot of things planned. We will be doing an install. Uh, basically, at the whole front end is getting carbon fiber. The rear end is getting pretty much changed up. A lot of different things getting installed. We also have 600 stars and suede headliner to do in a BMW. And um, we're starting a 340 wrap this weekend. So stay tuned for that. A lot more content coming very soon. I'll put a couple clips of how the car looks outside just to get a better uh, look at it. But I mean, this thing definitely turned out pretty clean. Put the spoiler on there, or put the front lip on there, and the winglets. Just got to do the spoiler. About to do that now. Um, but this thing pretty much turned out crazy. Did went ahead, did the black door handles, black roof. To match we did the antenna and the satin gray he actually decided to keep the mud flaps in the gloss version of this color 
So we also did that. Can't really tell, but it gives it a little bit more of a accent to it. Um, like I said, I'll get some better videos when it's outside, but you can kind of see the rear bumper there. Yeah, definitely turned out super clean. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and uh, I'll catch you guys next time. All right, so we're gonna do a quick walk around the car. It's a little bit dark outside, so bear with me. But uh, we got the flash on right now and this thing was pretty clean. Try to flash it up a little bit just so you guys can kind of see a little better. thing looks crazy look at this front end custom front end i kind of made this up on my own you guys can see back there the q has it on there i think he's pulling up now garage sticker on there we installed the spoiler uh, and he'll be back this weekend to do the diffuser and the, the front grill all right guys so I will resume this video this weekend show you guys what it looks like with the new gloss black emblemless grill and the third brake light diffuser we're also going to be installing on the car <laughs> Turn the lights on. Yeah. Yeah, I ain't seen nobody with that diffuser yet. <laughs>